are we going to anti-age today? Anti-aging miracle. Life expectancy. Fountain of youth. It's already here. But how far should science go? It is in this part. Anti-aging. Attitude. That's what keeps a person young. I think meditation probably holds the key. Short bursts of intense activity. Less quantity, higher quality. That is the purpose of life, is to find the path. Good food, it quiets the mind, and a quiet mind unties the knots of the heart. As you practice meditation, your body's natural youthfulness is liberated. So emotions of extreme natures, without a doubt, ages. We're an upright column of walking ocean water. The body is created to move. Most people get stiffer and weaker. I'm getting stronger and more flexible. The number one cause of ongoing headache pain is painkillers. Walk barefoot touch the earth, and eat foods that are rich in antioxidants and calcium and magnesium. Stress causes the aging process. You know how it is. When you're under stress, you start looking older. We can't eliminate all stress from our lives, but we can come up with a strategy to deal with it better. You don't drink enough water. Give your life to serve to help the planet. The most important thing is to believe. We're not meant to digest meat. Water before food. Is it possible that our thoughts can make us well? We need to focus not on living long, but living right. The mind is a contractor that reads the blueprints. And if we have a goal beyond our life, we live longer. If you don't know why you're here, then why be here?